when we construct a wind farm, first of all, the most important thing is to find the right location where there are no conflicts, no obvious conflicts with the environment. So we have to make pilots, we have to find what are the, what are the obvious projects at the specific location, at the specific region. Let's try and go over to this turbine now that we have the opportunity to get so close. When we install our turbines and we have this scour protection around the turbines to avoid erosion, that it has attraction on marine life, so it, it generates a habitat for fish, for shellfish, for crustaceans, where they can feed and they can seek shelter. We have known that for a long time. But now we are looking much more focused into if we change the de design, so a technical design a little bit, will that actually improve the positive impact? So every time we construct an offshore wind farm, we become better at the technical aspects. I see it's the exact same with the biodiversity projects. For each biodiversity project that we make now, we become better. We find the right solutions, enabling us to scale up these initiatives. That will enable us to deliver on our biodiversity goals, where we want to leave nature in a better state than before we started constructing the project.